Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and sharing commentary with me as usual is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's Dinamo Zagreb up against Milan. Yes, cheers Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in there, the underdogs. But if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. The lineup then for the hosts. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. And here's how Milan will line up. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Olivier Giroud. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway but it did look dangerous for a moment but the keeper has it now Sandro Tonali Rafael Leao Ben Asser. on the ball Rafael Leao Hernandez determined block Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. Sends it back. Splendid defending. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And that was a very fine read. Has the strength to hang on to it. Oh, super piece of play. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Ben Asser. Calabria. And the pass could do damage. It's a weighted pass. Can they take the lead? Still could be dangerous. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Chance to cross. Well, they've started the game really brightly, and that was so close to taking the lead. Well, a game of such fine margins, but let's see if they can create another opportunity. And the flag does go up. Must have been close. not a good pass bad challenge and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next well he's gone into the book well he was late and he deserved a booking for that
Mateo Hernandez. Tonali with it. Giroud. Ariana Demi. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Olivier Giroud. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Calabria. Well, tremendous block. Who can they pick out? Well, I think it's fair to say the pressure from the defender puts him off a bit. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, Milan very much dictating the tempo over the last 15 minutes or so and looked a real threat going forward. But they must take one of these chances while they're having this good period that you do sense it's coming. Yes, who knows? Maybe another opportunity in the works for them. Petkovic. Ademi on the ball. It's a neat move. Teammates in the middle. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Calabria. Junior Messias. Benassa. And he read it well, intercepting it. This is looking threatening. Hernandez. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Now can they counter clinically? They need to get bodies back. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Well, it was a brilliant break, but no goal as a result. Well, forget the finish and just admire the way they counter-attacked there. They did it with such pace and quality. Ben Asser. Tonali with it. Calabria. Junior Messias. Charles de Quetelare. Promising attack, this. Benasser. A wonderful intervention. Bruno Petkovic. And space to exploit, maybe. But timely defending when it mattered. And does well to keep it in play. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Mishic. On to Petkovic. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come. Teo Hernandez. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. This looks more than decent. Benasser. Must be. And the keeper getting across to stop it.
Now sending it in. Oh my goodness, he's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. That is that for the first half here. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Giroud. Leal. And since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, I have a feeling we're going to see this time and time again tonight. It's a fantastic bit of technique. Just to get that much lateral movement on the ball, wonderful strike. So the ball rolling again, 2-0 the score. Ariana Demi. It's with Josip Mišić. What a crucial intervention inside the box. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Well, possibilities in the centre. Taking care of business defensively here. Well, Milan are controlling the possession, as you can see. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Yes, yeah, really going so well. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now.
Giroud. A smart stop here. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Well, the keeper deserves a Oh, hang on, Stuart, it's a chance. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Giroud. And a fine stop to turn the ball away. Bruno Petkovic. Mislav Orsic. And he has options available. But the danger averted for now. A foul, but advantage played. Ben Asser. Rafael Leao. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Oh, he's really opened them up here. Oh, a superb save. Giroud. And taken away. He won the ball. Mislav Orsic. Teammates available, but they dealt with the threat first. The supporters want to see him have a go. Now can they counter clinically? Hernandez. A wonderful intervention. Mislav Orsic. That's useful play. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Calabria. Nearing the end of the contest, and Milan are cruising, quite simply. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created and a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Good officiating, waiting for the play to stop, and now going back to caution him. Well, they've decided to make a change. Well, the execution there rather went awry. Well, Derek, the less that, the better, I think. Rafael Leao. Giroud, and he's through here. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Substitution time it is here. And continues his run. And it's played into the centre. And there it is! A goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best.
Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Ben Asser. Tonali with it. Teo Hernandez. That's a well-struck pass. Rafael Leao. Really getting stuck in defensively as far as stoppage time is concerned three minutes here and they could face difficulties here well a big sigh of relief that nearly proved costly well he got away with that one didn't he it's a good recovery though Mislav Orsic so full time it is and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign yeah that's a good win and a vital three points another win next time out and they'll be in a great position well this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance hasn't he Stuart well he looked a top class player today every time he touched the ball he was a threat and he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.